listen, what I've gotten here is that people have become even more jealous of the chosen ones because of how they handle their struggle. Like, what kind of crap is that? Like, who wants to be jealous of a struggle? Some people see that you struggle. They try to put you through this struggle. They're, they've tried all that they can do to get you to struggle, to get you to give up on life. And they want you to give up, right? But see, they see how you're handling it and how you're making sure that what you do is on God's time and that you're doing it the way that he wants you to do it. And they can't understand how you always get back up every time you go through your struggle or you're doing things aren't happening the way that they should in your life. And they watch you because obviously, you know, they're watching you. We already know that because, you know, we, we the chosen ones. They're supposed to watch us. They're actually supposed to watch us and be inspired, be inspired by us. But that ain't what they're doing. <laughs> they're watching you to try to take you down, okay? To try to take you down. And so the things that are happening to you and they see that what they're doing may have worked, but you're handling it a little bit different than what they thought you would handle it, okay? They thought you was gonna give up and trip out and just really just lose your mind. That's what they thought. But the thing about it, most people don't understand that when it comes to the chosen ones, we are actually held up. The most high keeps us going. We're definitely stronger than what they think we are. And the thing about it, that's why they become jealous. They see the things that you have beforehand. They see the people around you that love you, that support you, that are there for you. And that makes them so embarrassed that it's, it really is extremely gets them to the core. It hits them in the core. And the thing about it, when they do what they're doing, whatever they're doing out there, I don't know if they're praying against you, whether they're doing their spell work, whether they're um, trying to send people after you, whatever they're doing behind closed doors, they know that it's really, it's their top game. They they went to their the most strongest thing that they have because they've got desperate. I told you guys in the other video, they're getting desperate over here. Like they're desperate. And so if it's not working, like what in the world is happening? Like, how can they go through this and not even be um, set back? How can they not even be upset about what's going on? You know, we handle our situations differently. See, we take it up on ourselves to go to the most high, to go to source, to stay plugged in and understand that what we're going through is only what God allowed because he's not going to put more on us than we can bear. 